Hi, I'm Carrie Med, Principal of Poland Regional High School. And I'm Sean Vincent, Principal at Whittier Middle School. We're here to talk to you today about the care and use of your school-issued iPad and the policies that surround the MLTI project. Each student will receive an iPad, smart cover, a bag, and a two-piece adapter for the iPad. Please make sure that whenever you're transporting, transporting your iPad out of school that you're using the bag that is provided. We want you to periodically check your iPad for any kind of visible damage to the screen or any dents and bring it to the ID department as soon as you see the something. Remember screens will break if dropped or enough pressure is applied to them. Don't pile books on top of your iPad. We want to make sure that you charge your iPads at home in the evening and leave these cords at home because they can get lost or stolen easily. If you charge it up at night, it will hold its charge for the whole day. Parents are responsible for supervising internet use at home, so please set your guidelines at home with your students. You must know where your iPad is at all times. If it's lost or stolen, you have to report it to Mr. Vincent and I immediately so that we can start searching for the iPad and report it to the police. School board technology and internet use rules policies must be followed at all times. Students may be subject to disciplinary action for violation of this policy. The policies are available online. So you can put apps on this iPad you may purchase them with a credit card or an iTunes gift card with permission using your school supplied MLTI Apple ID. Do not use your own personal Apple ID on the school issued iPad. If we find that you've done this, we will not be responsible for the data that is lost as a result of it. Heat, cold, and liquids are really bad for iPads. And no stickers may be applied to the iPad. Cleaning them off could damage the housing. Use only a soft microfiber cloth to clean the screen. Do not use any type of spray. All repairs to your iPad must be done only by the school IT department. iPads cannot be taken to other service providers. No liquids are on the iPads. Liquid spills are always considered negligence, and you will be billed for any damage caused by liquid. All students are charged a non-refundable device use fee each year. This fee helps to defray the cost of repairs not covered by the warranty. It's important to know, however, that if you are negligent with your iPad, you will be charged for some cost of the repair. The use fee is $30 per student, $25 for reduced lunch, $20 for free lunch, and it is not an insurance policy. Online digital behavior, uh, digital citizenship, downloading, etc., that's all going to be covered this year during the course of the school year. We're also going to spend a lot of time talking about cyberbullying here at school. And we just want to say that internet filtering is not foolproof, so monitoring your students' behavior online is really important. Thanks, and have a great school year.